前情提要 ：J D 跟 d e b n e y 的访问第一次因为没录到影，所以重新开录后，他们要重新开场，假装第一次见到彼此。So we should like begin the whole procedure again, right? <laughs> Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah. Probably. Okay. <laughs> Now it's recording. Okay, so we can act like okay. we just met each other. Yeah. Oh my God, Danny! Hi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> It's an honor to meet you. Let me introduce myself. I'm JT. I'm a YouTuber slash blogger from Taiwan, and it's such an honor to meet you. I've been such a fan for a long while. Like, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So nice and to meet you as well. So、um, it's my first time doing interview. So yeah, I'm a little bit nervous. Hope we can all have a wonderful time later. <laughs>、oh, we're gonna have a really nice time. Don't you worry. Hopefully, be your first person to interview. I feel、Thank、very honored. Yeah. <laughs> so would you like to say hello to Taiwan a little bit because a lot of people love you? <laughs> yeah. Hi Taiwan. It's so nice to like. Speak with you, and I'm so happy that you、uh, are loving my music. Yeah, yeah. thank you. <laughs> so let's begin. So first,、um, congrats on the release of the new track, Highs and Lows. It's such like a really good track for me. I feel like it's like a different sounding from you. It's more like emotional and ballad-ish song that. I haven't like heard you sing that many that kind of songs. Would you like to share a little bit of the background story or some, you know, inspiration of the creation of the track? Yeah, and first of all, good observation because it's true. I haven't done a lot of.、Um, I haven't done a lot of ballads. I mean, I definitely have done some songs that have felt. Um, you know, more maybe emotional and more、uh, personal, but still in an upbeat way. So I do、yeah. feel like highs and lows are kind of、uh, create like、uh, representing something new.、Um, not that I'm gonna be doing only ballads, but it's nice to do a song <laughs> that I feel like I haven't done before.、Um, And I would say, you know, I was really inspired by writing a song that, because、um, I guess highs and lows is about, you know, choosing to stand by someone's side through all the ups and the downs. And、um, I think what I really love about the song is that when I played it to people, people always had like their own take on it, like whether it was. Um, you know, they were thinking about a family、uh, situation, or whether they were thinking about a close friend, or whether they were thinking about like a romantic relationship. And I think that it's a, you know, it really shows that the the song can、um, can speak to people in many different ways. Because I think all relationships, if you are close with someone, will naturally have. Ups and downs. That's very、yeah. really、nice. <laughs> so the <laughs> next question I would like to ask is about the music video. I've seen it like several times, and I think that music video is like very like simple yet very beautiful. So would、mm. you like to talk a little bit about like some interesting behind the scenes story about the creating of the music video? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I I I never know how much I should say or not say to kind of ruin it. But actually, the song was something that I decided on.、Uh, I decided、uh, we. I, I decided.、Um, I decided on a Tuesday that I was going to release the song, and then the next Friday we did we delivered the mastered, and then Monday. So. Not even two weeks after I decided to release the song, we had already done the music video and everything. So everything was very fast, and I felt like I was had a very clear idea. You know, I wanted it to feel,、um, you know, as you said, quite simple and raw,、uh, in the same way that I wanted the song to have focus on the words and the vocals instead of. You know, being lots of production and stuff happening. I really enjoy that setting. I feel like the light,、uh, that white light, the circle that I'm sitting in, and then you have all the kind of 
the the dark around it was like a nice image for me of like the you know the highs and lows and the the light and the slight more darkness and the kind of very strong contrast between the two so um yeah i'm very happy with how it turned out i i really wanted it to feel just very close and not too fancy i guess yeah i think it's a really like a really personal work it's fo more focused on like yourself glowing and all kinds of stuff and i think that's <laughs> very beautiful <laughs> thank you and <laughs> thank you as well <laughs> so what is the new music direction you're currently taking on because i uh, listened to uh, you have like two songs released this year what is the new dagny music going to be like what is the vision inside your head <laughs> yeah um that is um it's interesting that you should ask about that because i just had a conversation like right before we we started talking um uh, about this and i think um i do feel like both bright sider and highs and lows have been more standalone tracks um i felt really connected to them so i wanted to put them out but without necessarily them having to represent everything that's coming. Um, I find that right now I'm in a very creative uh, mindset. Like uh, I've just finished a lot of touring and I'm so eager to just be writing and making a lot of new songs. I just came back from Los Angeles. I've been spending three weeks there just writing every day. I still like to keep an open mind just because I am still feeling so inspired by trying new things. Um, but I definitely have written a lot of songs over the last two years that I'm very connected to. I can't wait to release them. I just... Uh, Excited! <laughs> yeah, and it's it's I'm so pumped to be releasing new music next year because now I obviously haven't released that much since the last album. But exactly how it's going to sound like, um, we're still kind of trying different things, I guess, with some very clear ideas, though. Yeah. That sounds good already. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm literally like, can't wait. <laughs> I can't hide my excitement, you know? <laughs> I really yeah, but that's nice. <laughs> I'm trying to like hide it, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> so like speaking of trying new things and directions, do you have mm -hmm. like because you know you've been trying tried like for example pop music, indie music, and now highs and lows, ballad music, and maybe some dance music? Would you have like having some like new music genre you would like to explore? Well, it's really fun that you say uh, dance music because I, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't necessarily say like, um, I definitely wouldn't say like EDM, but I, I, I would say that um, after having played so many shows this year, um, I, I do a lot of songs that are very upbeat, but not necessarily like super <laughs> Dance to. More like groovy, so, groovy. <laughs> yeah. So recently I've been very inspired by songs that just have like rhythms that you kind of want to naturally just move to. And that's something that I've been trying to incorporate into the songwriting as well. That it's like, it's not just going to be like, you know, big chorus, but also having a kind of a rhythm that, you know, would be easier to dance to just because, I mean, I think dancing is fun. And when I'm at a festival, I just want to like let loose and, and dance and have a great time. So that that is something that I've been thinking a lot about. And then, you know, you mentioned indie music. Um, I don't know if it's for this album or for a upcoming later album, but um, I really love a lot of indie music. I listen mostly to, um, I, I listen a lot to indie music. So at some point I would like to make an album that is like even more organic sounding, maybe even bring in my band and just record everything only with my musicians. Um, you know, that could be really fun. Um, so there are a few different things I would like to do, but uh, but I think uh, definitely making some songs that people can dance to would be really awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Still can't wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Work in progress, so, I'm telling you. Yeah. <laughs> so um, I've been like, you know, 
searching like your Instagram account for a bit while, and I've seen you sometimes post the songs you、uh, like listen on your stories or something, and I think you have like a wonderful music taste. So、Hi. I would like to know <laughs> what kind of song that you will listen during your highs and lows. Like oh, good yeah. one. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. I've just been in,、um, as I said, I've just been in California, and a lot of music that I listen to, I immediately can just imagine myself driving around in like LA, and it's very much the kind of driving music. I've been obsessing over.、Um, um, there's,、uh, you know, Haim. There's a band called、oh. Haim, Three Sisters. I know, I know.、Um, they have a song called.、Uh, uh, Up from the dream, up from a dream,、um, and it's one of my favorite songs at the moment. I listen to it all the time, and then I also、um, have listened a lot to、um, this song "Phoenix"、uh, by Big Red Machine. Oh,、uh, I know that. <laughs> yeah, I love that song as well, and that's one of those songs that you listen to it and you can feel uplifted. But also, you can listen to it and feel like really com- comforted. Like you can listen to it both in a high and a low state of mind, if you know what I mean. Yeah.、Um, I mean, I think. Well, let me have a look at my phone here. What what I've been listening to other than that, "Up from the Dream" is definitely like a, an up song. I always get in a good mood when I put it on. Let's just have a look. Oh, and I actually really like one of the new Tove Lo's songs. That、um, album is amazing, right? <laughs> so good. So damn、ah, good. good. <laughs> yeah, it's so high good. Five, high five, high five. Yeah. So that、so、been, and also I've been obsessing over some of her obsessed, music videos. Obsessed, literally obsessed. <laughs> yeah, definitely. So so there's been some of the stuff that I've been like listening to recently, and you know it's weird, but I really like music that fits both moods.、Um, sometimes you know you just want to put on a super upbeat song, like some old like Katy Perry or some old Taylor Swift, and just like. Feel really excited and happy, but a lot of the music that I listen to now is kind of falls like perfectly in with whatever you're feeling. You can, if you need to feel uplifted, it has that effect on you, and if you need to feel just like comforted,、um, then it also has that effect on you. So it's just magical. Music is magical. Yeah, I love music. <laughs> okay, so I think. We're coming to an end of this interview, so I mean it's a little bit sad. <laughs> yeah, it's so sad.、Yeah. It's just nice. So the last question I'm going to ask is: Would you like to pay Taiwan a visit, and what kind of culture would you like to experience the most? Oh, I would love to come and visit. I have definitely played way too few shows,、um, you know, in general Asia, and I think.、Um, Obviously, now with two years of not being able to travel so much, it was kind of even harder to make that happen. But that's something that I would really love to do.、Um, I think also in general, like Asia and also South America. I've never been to South America, and I I feel like there's some really amazing festivals and just cultures in general to experience and.、Um, And I don't know. I, I, I really love traveling. I, I love meeting new people and tasting new food and seeing places and just the vibe of different places. So I'm really wanting to kind of do more traveling, especially now when we're able to again. So that's, yeah,、uh, we welcome you. <laughs> I'll come and see you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I think that's a wrap. And thank you for your time. I'm having a good time. I hope you、Me、have、too. it as well. <laughs> yeah. So, that- Um, that was a great、uh, first interview. High five! Thank you.、That. High five! <laughs> Do you like want to learn the Chinese of bye bye? <laughs> yes. It, it's pronounced as Z A I Zai. Zai. And, and J E N J. Zai. No, say that again. Say it all in one. Z A I Zai and J E N J. Zai Jin. Zai Jin. 
Yeah. <laughs> All right. Good. Bye. Yeah, that's the red legend. <laughs> bye bye. Thank you so Bye. Much. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much. You know